All this week, we're looking back at some of the year's top stories, and this morning, we're focusing on the world of entertainment. Early show national correspondent Hattie Kaufman reports on the stars who thrilled us, shocked us, and left us. This is the moment. This is it. Mm. Don't stop till you get it on. 2009 may best be remembered for what the entertainment world lost, Michael Jackson. We met him in 1971 as a 12-year-old powerhouse. He was an icon of the 70s. Superstar of the 80s. His sudden death at 50 on the eve of his comeback tour brought shock, sadness, and a celebration of his music like no other. Smooth coming. Hold for applause, fade out. Thank you so much. For Taylor Swift, the applause got louder. She turned 20, won awards that usually take a lifetime, and scored sympathy points when Kanye West really crashed you, one moment in finish. the spotlight. But Beyonce had one of the best videos of all time. No. Adam Lambert had his own award show controversy. The glam rocker's racy moves slowed but didn't stop his post-idol momentum. I did get carried away, but I, I don't see anything wrong with it. It was hard to take your eyes off Lady Gaga's outrageous costumes. A year ago, she was an opening act, but her sexy style brought her center stage. I have uh, had sex with women who work for me on this show. David Letterman admitted past affairs and detailed an alleged extortion plot against him by 48 Hours producer Joe Haldeman. Singer Chris Brown offered a guilty plea for attacking then-girlfriend Rihanna. But this TMZ photo of the battered beauty may keep Brown's career rehab on hold. It's sad. It's cut short. John and Kate plus eight subtracted one when Kate Goslin filed for divorce. With the series now canned, Kate is shopping around a talk show. <laughs> Meanwhile, Oprah, the world's most famous talk show host, announced that next season, her 25th, will be her last. Hollywood celebrated a record year at the box office. Paranormal activity made for only 15,000 scared up 100 million in ticket sales. And New Moon brought Twihard fans a sequel to scream about. And we remember those who took their final bow from the CBS News Control Center. I am on the way to the moon. Like a comet blazing across the evening sky. Here's Johnny! Gone too soon Like a rainbow Not my kids. Fading in the twinkling of an CBS News, Hollywood. Just wanted to say I love him so much.